Why do you always release your semen outside each time we make love? Um. Hey, babe, look. Whatever I do, I have my reasons. What reason? I don't have a baby now. What? Why? I want to have kids now. Besides, I'm scared of menopause, so I want it now. <laughs> babe, babe, you're gonna crack me off menopause. You're barely 28 and you're talking about menopause. Well, is it when I'm 40 we'll start thinking of having kids? I understand, but I, you, know, you know what? Let's talk about this. I have to go to the shop right now, okay? What is it with you men? Each time I raise up a very important issue, you just want to shy away from it. What is this? Babe. Like I said, man, I kept back. No, but I want to talk about this now because I really want kids. Sweetheart, it's I, what I want. I know. I, I, I listen to you, right? When I get back, we'll talk about it, okay? Hey, I love you. And yes, I have a couple of clothes and the wardrobe is down there. Just help me tidy them, okay? I love you. I'll see you soon when I get back. Okay. Love you, Nancy. is always hard to swallow. Why can't she be asking me to put her in the family way when we are not married? She said we should elope. I concord. We eloped together. Why can't I be pregnant in her when I haven't even paid a dime on her head? I need to do things the right way. Hmm. I'm not impregnating her until her father, Chief Ruben, accepts my diary. Yeah. What do you with this one, man? Are they hungry? Look at, since the morning I never eat. Almost 10 o'clock. No, 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 almost 10 o'clock, they knock now. Huh? Eh? They never serve me food by this time. Nah. Eh? Ha! Nonsense, you. Oh. Take a breakfast. Take! No, give me. No, I'm going to eat. Ah! Come here! Come here! Come here. What if it is? Your breakfast now. My breakfast, if I carry this thing knocking for head now, this long cap now go come up for head. Damn it. You the cook porridge beans for me for breakfast. Mm. What did happen to the egg, uh, toasted bread? Egg sauce and mm. uh, plenty milk with the palm vita. Africa. Ah. Play your mouth. What's up? Okay, sorry. Uh, yeah, it's up to your mouth. Clean out. Clean out well. You like me very mm. well. No wonder. Clean out well. <laughs> All those things just mention now. You want them for breakfast? Yes! Now now you talking, Mary. Get a good job. I suppose get a table. When you go there, you serve me for, hey. for this house. You don't do it. Time table. Yes! yes. For you. Yes. For you. <laughs> Chief, Africa, if you Chief like, Oda. eat this food. If you like, don't eat it. Eh? You think I will die from hunger? Keep it there. Don't eat it. Eh? You are don't wicked. Eat. You are wicked. I beg. No wonder you do exactly this is money. They cook porridge beans for me. So that if I eat and finish, what do you people gonna hear from my, 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 my backyard? Yeah? <laughs> like where did they do Boko Haram from? But it's not gonna be better for you. It's not gonna be better for you. I don't say I can't give you money. My mother can give you money to cook cook better food for me. Now you can't cook uh, porridge yeah, from for this animal. That they will have a book in Mary. Don't only make a bubble. You want to eat that fish? What you gonna eat? Pa, 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 pa. Ewe, ewe. Oh, give me Kentucky, manum. Oh, you said it that this game was your meal ticket to wealth. <laughs> hey, brother, my mother, how far now? When I was on the chat. chat. On the chat is there. Oh. Mm. We are managing. Hello. How is the wife? <laughs> Brother, you and I know I'm not married. Eh, but you guys have been living for two months now. Look, that does not make us married. Look, I only crave that man's acceptance of my diary. I, 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 I just don't understand this whole thing. See, 
You need to try as much as possible to make sure that man does not control your mental health. Too. Eh? Funny thing is, Nelly wants us to start procreating. That's a good idea. See, let me tell you something. Once you guys start having babies now, that man will have no other option than to accept you. But you know now, that can happen. Why? I mean, things have to be done the right way. The right way? Yes. Was it right when you looked to the daughter to Asaba? What are you saying? See, my brother, this is what you've always wanted. You have it now. Everything done sure. You just have to play along. I mean, you started it now. Finish what you start. My brother, what can I offer you, Jerry? Eh? Nah. <laughs> nah. Hey, see, do you know do you know how much is one roll of this wire? This is money, you go. <laughs> can't eat now, can't eat yourself. One, two. Hey! hey. My brother, you have arrived. Thank see, you, I'm not sure I'm going back home. <laughs> there are rooms everywhere, my brother. <laughs> if you supervise, let me do. <laughs> Which one are you? Come on, carry, carry your plate. Carry your mouth shop. You will finish the entire food, all, all the math you are making. If I, if I, if I, if I, I slap you now, if I forget my hand for your face. Okay, try Nothing much. Uh -huh, let me come, come, come. Come now, do the best like it. But of course. Talk. Get with the whole action. Go ahead. <laughs> You don't day. Why well, use my arm? My eye. See Nelly. Abby, you don't say. Africa. Huh? Why are you asking me all these questions now? Why are you asking me such questions? Why? See, it be like say, that's more, madam. Don't carry your guard dollar. Run away with that boy. That boy, where they feel fine, boy. We no get shishi. We no even get naira. Talk less of dollar. Go eh? carry money, go run away with her. Africa. Yes? It's like you don't have any job to do in this compound today. You don't have any work to do. Leave me alone, no. Ah! Ah! If I slap you, now you get yourself. Are you okay? Can you slap me? <laughs> Please get smart. Ah! Get away, you! <laughs> Nonsense. See, they even managed to give you yellow feet like that. Ah! Come here. Yeah. The nonsense, please. You know, see, kind of peace when you do. And they talk important to say, I got picking the news. They don't carry my organ on the news. I didn't have the correct naira. They didn't have the talk news. Don't let it go bomb quite a bit. Ngala Kusel. What are you saying? You mean you have not been able to reach Nelly on the phone? At least to ascertain her whereabouts? My friend, I think she must have changed her number. What? This is more serious than I imagined. I blame Chief for all of this. If he had accepted that boy in the first place, all these things wouldn't have happened. But no, he was eager to push her into your son's arms. You see, the moment we realized they don't have feelings for each other, we allowed our son be, right? Yes, yes, yes. Today, he is married to his heart trauma. Not only being married, happily married and expectant. You don't say. Yes. Very soon I'm going to be a grandmother. Sandra is eight weeks gone. Oh, wow. This is good. If only my husband had allowed Nelly and Kai and got married, I would have been an expectant grandmom. My friend, you have to look for your daughter. She's the only daughter you've got. Papando, you must look for your daughter. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I don't have a daughter anymore. Hmm? Nelly seems to be my daughter the day she stole my money and they looked with that. That son of a lunatic, she stole from you? Yes, she stole my dollars, my client's dollars. I kept in my wardrobe. This is serious. I didn't know all that happened. I never knew. Yeah. 
that's what happened. So that's why she ceased to be my daughter. And I warned them. Any day I see her or that boy, that gold digger, anywhere around my house, I'll shoot them. And I'm not missing what about it. Please. Please. Temper justice with mercy. Please. Forgive her. No matter what. You must forgive your daughter. Yes. Just look at my family, for example. I allowed Junior to follow his heart. Exactly. And uh, today, he is not just uh, happily married, but he will soon become a father. And I, a grandfather. Please, let it go, my friends. I plead. Listen, doctor, your own case is different. Junior is a man. This is the lady we are talking about here. If she gets married to that gold digger, they will live off me for the rest of their life. And I won't allow that to happen. Never. Chief, see, everyone deserves a second chance. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Everyone. And then Nelly deserves a second chance. Exactly. Of course. Huh? See, you see, if you beat up a child with the right hand, mm -hmm. you draw her back to yourself with the left hand. Exactly. You, you must forgive Nelly. Please, Chief. Huh? I'm pleading with you as your friend. You're my friend. Please. <laughs> Please. My okay. Husband. My husband. Please, I beg of you. Bring these children home and bless their union. Please. Exactly. So you don't believe what I said to you that that boy is a good guy? Hmm? Chief, please. My friend, I beg, have your drink. Let's. Please, Chief. Please. Hmm. please. Yeah. I'm just a girl in love. I didn't know I'd fall like this. What can I do to prove my point? Cause I made up my mind to follow my heart. I don't care about the consequences. I'm gonna go any length to be with you. Cause I love you and I want to, gotta be with you. I fell out of line. Even with my pride, I fell in love helplessly. Knowing you were right for me, but I can't stop myself from loving you. From loving you. Oh, it's so easy to fall for you. I was a star that lasts forever. You love me, I love you. Together we'll stay forever. It's so easy to fall for you. It's so easy. Oh, you love me. I love you. Love Together we'll stay forever. forever. I can't stop myself from loving you. Oh, I can't keep myself from loving you. My husband, please forgive her. She's our only mm. daughter. Please. You saying I should forgive her after all she did? Huh? Yes, Chief. Please, forgive Nelly. Please. No, no. Papando, for the past two years, Nelly left this house and disappeared into thin air. My friend, let's go out there in search of her. Let's do it. Yes. Let's say no. My, my, my friend, please, that is why I am here. Yes. That is why the two of us visited. Please, let's plan on how we are going to look for Nelly. Yes. Mike, I'm disappointed that you are, you are, you are telling me this. After all you know about me, after all you know, about what the girl did to me. I told you she took my client's money and ran away. You want me to go and bring her back so that she will wreak more havoc with that, that liar? Papando, Why are you doing this to me? If she said it's that boy she wants, then let us give them our full support. And I said no. 
The money she stole from me, I am still paying for it till today. So why is everyone telling me to forgive her? Eh? I can see your hair bent on killing me before my time. But know this, even in death, I will never forgive you. My spirit will haunt you for the remaining days of your life. Oh, no, no, don't say that. Oh, Madam. 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 Come back. Madam. Uh, my, my friend, you need to calm down. You need to calm down. Ah! I'm not like that. I'm, I'm down. No, 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 no. Let's go and look for the doctor. Let's do the needs for. That, that's where we met. I said, no. Chief. Papa Lou. Papa Lou. Chief, please. Allow it to fly. Please. Let's not dwell on the past so that we can forge ahead. Be Chief. Chief, please, sir. How do you drink your, your drink? Hello? <laughs> sir? <laughs> Asaba is fine. Hi, Sonicha. Sam, you needed to see who I just saw. The MD's daughter. Yes. Ah, ah, Sam, she, she's looking so haggard. The Nelly you know, that beautiful Nelly. She's now looking very, very unkept. Sam, she's in the wrong hands. She's in the wrong hands. She's not looking fine at all. I've never been serious. Sam, I'm very, very serious. You, you need to see how she looks so, so bad. Um, anyways, Sam, I have to go. I have to go. Hmm? I have to go. <laughs> Sam of... <laughs> ah! Baby, mm -hmm. Chief Ruben's branch manager saw me today at the mall. Baby, I thought I told you to stop frequenting the mall. I mean, you could go to the market to get whatever you want. Imagine him asking if I was okay, that I don't look good to him. You don't look good? Like this? Well, yeah, I actually thought about it. The truth is, I... I I don't look good. I think you're overstressing me. What he said is true. I, I'm not the way I used to be. I. You think I'm overstressing you? What were you thinking? You think my discharge play? Huh? All I'm saying is, um, you should help. You know, help out with um the chores in the house since we don't have a maid due to your insistence so i feel like you could help me a little bit here and there so i will go to the shop and you expect me to come back home and do the house chores when i have a woman in the house how eh? baby it's not like i did any chores in my father's house I had domestic stuff for that. Oh well, it's unfortunate you did not come with anyone here. But all I'm saying is you could just help out a little, just a little. You I'm know not what saying... I'm... Hey, hey, babe, enough of these complaints, please. Do you do you realize that I, I I do all the chores? I still perform my duties in the bedroom. I'm human too. Enough of these complaints, okay? By the way, I'll be traveling to the village. So... Village, but you. You frequent the village these days. Are you building? And you haven't told me? If I was building, I would tell you. I mean, why should I hide anything from you? You'd be my support system. Besides, you haven't introduced me to your mom. I will, okay? Hmm? I love you. I love you too. I should go take my bath. Okay. Matthew, 
You mean you saw Nelly in Asaba? Yes, ma. I saw her right in the morning. She pretended not to understand what I was talking about. She even had the boldness to, to make it clear to me that she doesn't have a father. That her father is dead. What? What won't do? Did you hear that? No, I didn't hear that. Babando, are you not going to say anything? Hi! I have lost my daughter completely. Oh. Hi! Ma, you people should try and bring her back to the family. Because when I saw her, she, she didn't look fine at all. She, she looked so haggard and emaciated. How am I sure my daughter is feeding well in the hands of that boy? Eh? Her father disowned her. She equally disowned her father. Which normal human being does that? Eh? Hey! Thank you for having me. Oh, oh, can see you? Hey, Jimo. Ma, my intuition tells me she's passing through hell in the hands of that guy. From the look that I saw that day, she's not fine. She's not fine. The worst part is that she switched off her phone immediately she left this house so that we cannot reach her. Yeah? This is more than I imagined. Honestly. I have a bigger challenge now. Which is? Oh, where to find her? Of course the shopping mall you saw her is not her house. I need to know where she stays. I will try my best. I will try my best. We need to find her. She needs to return back to her family. Uh, yes, please. Uh, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I'll try my best. Thank you. I'm just a girl in love. I didn't know I'd fall like this. What can I do to prove my point? Oh, who is there? Because I made up my mind oh. to follow my heart. Oh. I don't care about oh. the consequences. Oh. I'm gonna go any length to be with you. Cause I love you and I want to. Gotta be with you. Okay. I hope my friend is in. Well, he traveled. Oh, he went to Lagos? No, 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 no. He went to the village. To the village? He didn't tell me he was traveling. Well, his mom called him. I think it's urgent. Well, in that case, I should be going back to Anita. Ah, no, 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 no. Sit, sit, sit. Don't, let me entertain you now. Ah, no, don't worry. Next time, okay? I insist, please. Just sit. Let me at least entertain you. Oh, okay, no problem. <laughs> hey! You can increase the volume if you want. Our wife! <laughs> Good to see you. Thank you. Wow. I'm telling you. Uh -uh. Hey. Ah, uh, please, then. Eh? You take this. Let me prepare something in the kitchen for you, okay? <laughs> no problem. Thank you. You're welcome, eh? Let me rush to the kitchen, eh? I'll okay. be right back. Thank you. My son, I called you here for an important discussion. I know why you called me here. You know why I called you? Yes, Mama, I got your message. That's why I'm here. Kennedy, since you already know why I called you, I want to ask you, when are you giving me my grandchildren? Grandchildren? Mama, with who? With the rich man's daughter, Nelly. The one you're staying with. Mama, I can't have any children with Nelly. I can't have any child with her. Did I hear you well? Picture poor movie. Picture poor young. I hope you didn't mean what you are saying. A girl that have sacrificed her life for you. A girl that left what she was, everything about her to come and live with you to make sure that you are happy. The same girl that made you what you are, that you're looking good today, is that girl. People have messed you up, called you sort of names. Is that girl that made you what you are today? And you want to leave her for who? Mama, Mama have you forgotten what she did? The girl that stole dollars from me. 
Is that who you want me to go have children with? Just imagine what you're saying. She stole dollars for you. Is it not to better your life? Is it not to make you... What, just imagine what you're saying. You're not calling her a thief. Because she stole something to make to better your life. Eh? Mama, I don't love her. Yes, she must have done all these things for me, made me look better and all, but I can't have kids with Nelly. Hi. Kennedy, I'm so surprised at you. Honestly, I'm highly disappointed in you for saying all these things. For a girl that have made you what you're a girl that made people started respecting you. You now want to name her that she's a thief. Now listen, I will not take this so. I've not heard what you're saying. You must marry that girl. I don't understand what you're saying. Which means what she was telling me all this while is true. Yes, I have to believe her then. Now, I'm actually cooking in the kitchen. Nothing much. Of course, of course. I'll do a follow up. My heart, I don't care Who is it? You know what? I'll call you back, okay? Let me attend to the door. I'm go Hold on! To be with you. Because I love you and I want to. Gotta be with you. Mommy, come inside, though. Ah, ah. This is my friend. I fell in love. Help me sleep. This is. <laughs> You're welcome, ma. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, please sit. You had a really long journey, sit down. Thank you, my daughter. You're welcome, ma. Thank you, mom. <laughs> that looks so. <laughs> From the pictures, I know you're Ken's mother. Yes. <laughs> and you are Nelly. Yes, ma. Hi. You are so beautiful. Thank you, ma. <laughs> oh, my Thank you, ma. Hi. Thank you, mommy. Thank you, um, mommy. You know what? Let me quickly entertain you, okay? Uh, uh, mommy, before hmm? then, I want you to enjoy this movie, okay? It's very interesting. Trust me. Uh, uh. Is it a Sophia movie? <laughs> it's a Sophia movie that I like watch. Oh my god. No, there's no software in this one. Yeah. But trust me, this is super interesting. You will enjoy it, I promise you. It's comic. Okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Let me quickly get you something, okay? Thank you. Okay. Hey. Hey. Ah. Here you are. All this. My son must be very, very lucky to have this beautiful girl as a wife. Uma rich man. Hi. Some rich men children, they they they, are, they used to be disrespectful. But in Nelly's own, she's different. Very, very respectful. Hi. Mommy. Uh, one more. Thank you. Take this one, eh? Yeah. Or just use it as appetizer. All this for me. Yes, I'm preparing something in the kitchen for oh, you. Thank this you. one is just appetizer. Oh. Uh, I guess for me. Let me uh, quickly round up in the kitchen. Uh, <laughs> hey. Appetizer. Appetizer. I don't know why these people that are learned, they used to give names in everything. Is this a not much? It's not only giving, giving it apeta, apata. I don't know. Do I even know what is apatanza? I don't know what is apatanza. But anyway, my son must be very, very lucky. Yes. I don't know why her father is very, very stubborn. Eh, he doesn't want to allow them be. He should allow them now. Eh? Hi. Hmm. Hello. Eh? Hey. Eh? Uh -huh. It's not now. Mm-hmm. It's not. <laughs> My daughter. I'm asking because I'm concerned now. Hmm? I did concern. Um you and my son should give me grandchildren. I need to carry my grandchildren. Biko. <sighs> Mommy, it's not my fault. I don't understand. Are you telling me that it's my son's fault? Exactly my point. I don't know the reason Ken is doing what he's doing. What is he doing? 
Can you believe that? When Ken and I make out, he practices the withdrawal system. Hey, ah? manager put on my grandchildren. Something you positioned well. For my son to yaba a motor zav womb. You use it and mold my beautiful grandchildren. That's what my son is removing. Eh? What is wrong with this boy? Is he mad? Eh? What has come over him? Honestly, Mama, I don't know what else to do. I've tried my best. I, I've done everything I can, sacrifices and all, just to show him how much I care about him. But I, I sincerely don't know what the problem is. My daughter, you don't need to worry. I'm here now. We must sort it out before I go. I have to talk sense into him. And I know he's my son. If I talk to him, he would listen. Don't worry. I'm going to talk sense into him. Enona, he will come and meet me here. Eguilem. Eguim. Eguilem. Mommy, if you be the one to speak with him and he will listen, I suggest by all means you do. Because I don't know what else to do. Don't worry. Okay. Ken is my son. And I know if I talk to him, he would listen. Can you imagine I even suggested that we have a court wedding? You know, pending when my parents will come around. But he blatantly refused. Hey, wo. Hey! Is anything wrong with my son? I hope, I hope it's not what I'm thinking. What? My daughter. I, 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 let it not be that my son cannot produce a, a, a children. Oh, oh yeah, oh, oh, John. Oh, Are you sure he can produce children? Mom, I, I don't... <laughs> that's not the problem. Uh -huh. Yes, Ken is all right down there. He, he's 100%, trust me. He, he just... I, I don't know what's come over him. I really don't understand. But as for fathering any child or children, he's very okay. Hmm. My daughter, don't worry. Eh? I'm here now. Eh? I'm going to sort everything out before I go. Another one. Uh, don't don't worry again. Thank you. Uh -huh, one. Mommy, please eat your food. It's getting cold. Don't worry. It's well. Hmm? Go. Nah. Honestly, wherever your father is now, wherever your father is in the grave, he will not be happy with you. See what his son has become. Honestly. Mama, I'm in this village for three reasons. Which are? To see you and check out my ongoing projects that is happening here. And also find myself a good girl in this community. A girl I can marry. Oh, oh, nah, oh, nah. So, which means all this why you are fooling that girl? Eh? I am not a part of this. I am not part of this at all, at all. I am not part of this. I didn't hear you. Let me go and get your food. Mama, Mama, don't worry. I'm not hungry. Let me just quickly go and check out the guys, my projects. Let me know what is happening there. When I come back, I'll eat. Who did this to my son? Who did this to my son that my son will not give me grandchildren? Who must have placed a curse on my son that he should not bear children? Whatever that person is planning, it will not work for him. Nelly, you don't look good to me. Who doesn't know the beautiful daughter of Chief Ruben? You were a ravishing beauty. The reason Ken fell in love with you in the first place I understand that you're looking out for me, but honestly, I'm fine. I don't believe you. Is there something you're not telling me? Are you going through some emotional stress? Nothing. Then you must have been stressing yourself one way or the other. There is nothing. Nelly. 
Nelly. I know that you are going through a lot at this point. It is time you go back to your father. No, I won't do that. Every father should want the happiness of their children and not the other way around. A father who doesn't want to see me happy or happy with the choice that I've made doesn't deserve to be called a father. How long are you going to continue? For as long as possible. If they want me to come back, then they have to accept Ken. Reunite with your family first. It doesn't cost a thing. No. Even if you want to marry Ken, you still need the consent and approval of your family as well as their blessings. Even Ken is not happy with the way things are going with you too. See, I've heard you. I know all these things. I'm not daft. Huh? Go on. Hold on, hold on. Uh, hello, hello. Hi. Hello. Uh, Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What are you doing here? Um, okay. I came to check on my brother. Oh, I I see. <laughs> I see. Um, my man is my name is Ken. Amaka. Such a pretty name for a pretty lady. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Dad, are you trying to say that Chief is still hell bent on this? Chief is still hell bent in not forgiving his only daughter. In that case, not even the poor can marry Nelly. <laughs> It's not about his poor state. Chief said that the guy in question is a mason. But he lied to them that he's a contractor. And the boss is that Nelly made away with Chief's dollars mm. and left home. This is actually more serious than I thought. Oh, wow. <laughs> and the worst is that nobody knows her whereabouts. That's huh. the problem. Galakwesi told me in confidence that Nelly has destroyed her SIM card. Yes, mm. Mm. Well, you all know I've tried calling her several times and I can't get through to her. Mm. Oh, really? Yes, I did. I called her three times, but I can't get her. Uh, I think I'll still call Chief. I'll talk with him. Well, um, I guess you wouldn't stop calling him to see if he can change his mind. No, 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 no. no. All I need to do is to keep pestering him so that uh, he will do the needful. Mm. In as much as I know that what Nelly did was bad, but Abandu has to forgive her and let them make peace. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. She make peace. You know my friend very well. Chief is very obstinate. You know him. But see, what both Abando and Nelly, this whole situation has put Galakwesil in a very tight corner. Her BP has been high since all this started. She has been on drugs. As for me, my conclusion is that this whole thing is very bad. This is really bad. Mm. Where could she be? Eh? Well, who knows? That boy, that boy <sighs> snatched her away from my son. The messing guy didn't know shit. He didn't snatch any shit from her. Is that what you have to say? It is what it is, Dad. You, you didn't play your game, man. You didn't play your game well. That you didn't play your game well. Um, so tell me, uh, are you based in this village? Yes. Oh, okay. Um, who's your father? Um, my father is um, Ogaziamaka. Ogaziamaka? Yeah. Ah, uh, wait. Do you know my father? Yes! Your mama, <laughs> you're famous! You're a son, famous musician that plays in ceremonies, traditional weddings, and. Uh, exactly! Uh, are you serious? Yes, yeah, my so father. So you're the daughter to Okazio Maka, wow! <laughs> amazing, amazing. Thank um, you. <laughs> uh, so, uh, are you married? Do I look married? Hey. Just... I'm not married. I'm oh. still a student. <laughs> it makes it better. I don't understand. Well, that's because I would 
สูนเบียสูนเห็นแล้วฮะยังไม่รู้ฟอนี่ I'm I'm serious look the truth is actually came to this village in search of beautiful wife and I think I've seen one I'm serious why are you laughing because it's very funny ah uh, okay you just met me ah uh, okay no problem I will think about it okay yeah. okay so basically this is one of my sites Wow. Yes. Ah, it's very big, go. I know. Thank you. <laughs> And it's very fine, so. Thank you. <laughs> um, can I have your number so I could let you go? Um. Um. No, it's fine. I could always talk to your brother. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh, Corey. All right. Thank you. Bye bye. I wish I could make it up there, there. Doesn't matter how, even with my pride. You see, this is what I've been talking about. Hmm. Honestly. You see, everything should be blamed on parents for their choices on their so-called children. Yeah, you're right. I so much feel for Nelly. You know, at some point we were both in this together. But after so much persuasions, um, uh, both parents has to let us be. Now we are together. Yeah. But why is Chief Ruben so difficult? Oh, Chief. Chief is such a hard nut to crack. <laughs> He's not an easygoing person. <laughs> you mean the stubborn type? You know, one thing about Chief is that he s stubborn. But trust me, he was doing the right thing by trying to protect his daughter. But just that the doctor didn't see him from that perspective. You see, um, what the doctor said is that the guy is a graduate, agreed. But then he doesn't have a job. Hmm. Well, I think he should go in search of his daughter. Who? Chief. Chief. Yeah, Chief. Uh -huh. Babe, I swear to anything, you don't even know Chief. Chief would never go in search of his daughter. That right. man. Such a hard head, I swear. He's not like that. That's not fair. It is his daughter we are talking about here. He should go in search of her. What? The same chief that I even heard that referred to the guy as a gold digger. What? Yeah, of course. He said the guy is a gold digger. The same thing your parents told me. Well, well, Remember? at least we won. <laughs> My parents said that, but we won. Yeah. Yeah, we can. And I have you. And I have you too, baby. <laughs> I love you. I love you too, baby. No, please. Mind the way you're turning your stomach, girl. Oh. Our baby, our baby. Yeah. Please, 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 please. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, just let me know when you're hungry so I can make you something. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Uh, mm -hmm. um, Engineer Greg is doing an amazing job at my site. I mean, I never knew that man who actually knows his onions that good. Ah, Mama, don't worry. Very soon, eh? I'll just take you there so you can see what's going on on my site. Eh? Eh, eh, Mama. Hmm. I met a very, very beautiful girl today. She said she's uh, Ogazi Amaka's daughter. Hmm. Ah, Mama, the girl is so beautiful. Look, I can't even wait to make that girl my wife. Ah, Mama, you want this girl? Oh, sharp now. Hey, Mama, I'm talking. You're not saying anything. Ah, Mama, Mama, you're not going to talk to me. Kennedy, Mama, I can't answer. Mama, no ge. Ebu pisi. Can answer so no la. Your food is ready. When you're ready to eat, it's on the dining table. Welcome. You look so good. Thank you, darlings. How are you? I'm good. Good. You're welcome. You're welcome. Mom, where's Wait. Nelly and why did she come to pick us from the airport? Yeah. Oh, okay. your sister went out. Went out? Yes. 
Yeah. Isn't she aware her brothers are coming back from Canada today? What do you mean? Hey, come on, my children. Your sister knows that her brothers are returning from sojourn in Canada. So? Like I said earlier, she went out. Okay, can you give us a new line so we could call her to tell her we're home? <sighs> Unfortunately, my darling, she hasn't changed that line after she lost her <sighs> home. <sighs> Look, it's good, bro. At least we're home, right? Good. When she gets back, she will see us. She'll meet us here. Please, come on, 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 So, how did the meeting go with the parish priest? What did you tell the Reverend Father? Uh, about our missing daughter and how you are the reason she left home. So, now that you have reported me to him, what has he solved? I never knew that I was married to a wicked man. Mm. Huh? I will always tell you the whole truth. How am I sure you don't belong to any secret court? If I'm a member of a secret court, what would you do? You run away? What triggers the brick of conscience? You need to save your energy for the worst to come because I have not even started yet. <laughs> Mom, what is it? What is all this bickering about? Uh... Your sons are here. Tell them. Uh... Tell them where their sister is because I can no longer continue to lie about the whereabouts Nelly to them. I will not. Uh, yeah. uh, you cannot drag me to your level. Never. You will not. But let me say for the sake of emphasis, that any day I see her feet in this house, I will kill her. What? I'm not joking. No. What? Okay. what are you talking about? You kill your own daughter. Ah, shut up. You shot me. Mom? Mom? What's this all about? Where is Delhi? Why didn't you ask your father? I believe he's in a better position to answer that. So you mean you lied to us when we asked about Nelly's whereabouts? The more reason I reported your father to the parish priest. But Mom, why will a father disown his own daughter? I mean, what for? I mean... Mom? Yes? Taz just asked a very vital question. What? Could she have done that is this bad? Theft. 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 <laughs> How? Listen, my children, a lot has happened in your absence. Okay, we have time. Go on. Well, I never knew things would turn out this way. Not that I'm in support of what Nelly did, but it's high time your father stopped. I was against her choice of man, but when I found out that the, what we were doing to her was driving her nuts, I had to let go. Mom, you are really confusing us the more. Eh? What is this all about? You just go straight to the point. I blame myself 100% for what is happening to my daughter. If I had given her my consent, things wouldn't have turned out this way. Now look at what is happening to my family. I'm talking in parables. I don't even understand anything. God. Why are you sounding so irrational? You're wicked. I hope you know what they're talking about. And what are you going to do to me? <laughs> Ruben, sorry to disappoint you. My head is way stronger for you people. What do you mean by that? Figure it out yourself. Since you claim you don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I hope you are in control of all these things you are saying, Mom. Ruben, swallow your ego and go find my daughter for me. Else you will not have peace in this house. Ruben, you heard me. There will be no peace. And I'm leaving this room for you to the guest room. You should be going to your father's house instead. Uh -huh. I made some pasta. Should I save you? Uh, well, don't worry. I'm not hungry now. I'll eat soon. I'm hungry, okay? Okay. Uh, babe, hold on, please. I... I need to pick this call, okay? Uh, hello? Hello? Hello, Amiya? 
How you doing? Uh, work is fine. Work is going on fine. We're, we're pushing. So, tell me, what is this news you wanted to tell me? If I could, if I could to marry me, are you, are you serious? <laughs> yeah, of course I'm, I'm excited. I mean, <laughs> this is, this is good news. What was that? Baby, hmm? uh, it was actually, oh. come on, it was. A long time friend that I met when I went to the village. Must have been last school over. I see. Yeah, so babe, um, I'll be traveling to the village for my mother's is in the installation. Really? Mm -hmm. Then I'm coming with you, right? Um, no. No? What do you mean no? No, 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 something like this cannot be happening and you're telling me no. No, I don't get it. What? I... Babe, hey, babe, calm down. Um, I mean, no, like... I'll go on my own, okay? No! This one, this time, I must go with you. And that's fine now. Come on! Mommy is having her uh, a conferment and you're telling me that I will not... That's that's a happy moment. That's Wait. that's the time I need to be there. No, I have to go with you, Wait, please. Hey, calm down. Don't get it twisted now. You're serious, aren't you? You know what? Never mind. Uh, no, babe, no, you can go. Babe, hey, listen. No, no, no don't, look. Don't touch me. Babe, I'm going to other places now. I'm not going to the streets. I have other places to branch. Okay, my love. Okay, you no, know, the next one we'll go together, please. You can just go and just leave me. Please. I'm not going to leave you. Please, now. Can you leave me? Huh? Um, I will leave you for the city pretty soon. Um, I would want my wife, my newly wedded wife, to stay here while I go, you know, arrange things for her to come. Yeah, I did not hear you well. I sure check it through. She will never stay here with me. Never. Um, not while I'm alive. Mama, Mama, why can't she stay here? This, this is my father's house now. And it's my husband's house. I would dictate who will stay here with me and who will not stay here with me. She will not. Mama, Mama, why are you talking like this now? Why would you not? Why would she stay here with you? Eh? I said she will not stay here. You want me to support you? You stabbed Nelly at the back by going to marry Amaka, the organizer, Amaka's daughter. And you want me to bring her in to support you in your crime? I will not. So wait, Mama. It's because of Nelly you refuse to follow me eh? to meet the kinsmen. Eh? It's because of Nelly you refuse to even accept the mar my marriage with Amaka. Because of Nelly. Of course, yes. You don't expect me to join you in that kind of uh, atrocity. And do you know what the, the gravity of the offense you committed? A girl that made you what you are. Mama, you it, left is, her. Is it a crime for me to marry your um, other woman? I said no now. Nah. If that girl, if you don't want to take that girl along with you to live in the city, take her back to her parents. She will not stay here with me. Take her back to Agaziamaka's place to go and stay and wait for you. She will never stay in this house with me. Never. Mama? Eh? Your mother supported you. How? I can never support such atrocity. Look at the way these girls made you. She made you what you are. And at the end, look at the way you pay her. Eh? You paid her with, 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 with sadness, with grief. I, I will not support that. Biko, just no, no, leave no, no. me alone. No problem now. No problem. Eh, no problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Uh -uh. Who did this thing to my son? Who did this to him? So, um, I'll be going back to the city so I could complete the house I'm building over there. Wait. You're building in the city and village at the same time? God is good. <laughs> I mean, business is booming. Um, but I don't understand. Where are you staying currently? Uh, um, okay, um, so my landlord gave all the tenants quick notice. Why? 
Because the bank bought the place and I'm sure they want to use the land for something else. Oh. Uh, okay, fine. Why can't I stay with Mama? Hey, look, you can't stay with Mama, okay? But why? Oh, fine, I noticed Mama doesn't like me. You know what? Look, don't think about it. Let me just go back to the city, okay? Finish up my house, do everything, you know, and come on, we stay away from here, okay? <laughs> that is funny, but I'm not happy about it. Hey, it's gonna be fine, okay? Good time, come. Mm -hmm. Don't miss me too much. I'll be back soon. I will. Mm -hmm. You know, I'll definitely miss you. You know. <laughs> it's I, um, so why don't you just walk me a little bit, okay? <sighs> I'm just a girl in love. I didn't know I'd oh, fall like this. this. What can I do to prove my point? Because I made up my mind. I am so sure when I was leaving father's house, I brought my certificates here. Did Ken? <laughs> no, no, he wouldn't dare. But where could they be? helplessly. <sighs> Knowing you were right for me, but I can't stop myself from loving you. I'm loving you. Oh. It's so easy to fall for you. It's so easy. I will just love and last forever. Last forever. You love me, I love you. Together we'll stay forever. I love it's so you. easy to fall for you. It's so I will just love and last forever. You love me, you love me. I, love I love you. Together we'll stay forever. I can't stop myself from loving you. Oh, I can keep nice. myself from loving you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Super sweet. Oh. Nice. Ah, oh, then who keeps pictures this day? Dreaming, just wake up. Wake up, you're still dreaming. This is not. No, 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 you won't do this to me. No, 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 God, no, not to me. You used me. 
You deceived me. Why? Hey, um, look, I'm sorry. I, I never meant to. You never meant to what? I never meant to hurt you. Um, really? What exactly did you mean to do, Ken? You stand there and you, you're saying sorry to me. For what exactly? Hey, please forgive me. For, for using me? Tell me. Hey. I'm listening again. Sorry. You're sorry? I'm also sorry, Ken. I should apologize to you, Ken. I stole for you, Ken. I made a lot of sacrifices for you. So, if you're saying sorry, what exactly are you sorry for? For getting caught? You're not sorry, Ken. And it's okay. You won. I lost. Nelly. I'm sorry. Please. I gave you years of my life, Ken. My parents were always right about you. They were the voice of reason. But I was too stupid to see. Can I? My father ostracized me for you. And you? You got married. Right? Under my watch. I should kill you. But you're not even worth it. Aside for your sister, you go now. Why are you all making it look as if I'm a bad person? I don't, I'm not going to go with you. Dad, I don't understand. Your only daughter has been missing for two whole years. And you're not even bothered. I don't guess it. <laughs> and her daughter walked away from her family home. Did I drive her? Did I chase her away? She walked away on her own and you're asking me to go looking for her. But, but mom said you disowned her. Is that all she told you? Yes. Didn't she tell you that she stole my $10,000? But dad, to hear is human. To forgive is divine. Eh? Just find a place in your heart to forgive her. We have only missed our sister ever since we came back. We have not seen her. Amen. <laughs> Ruben, if you know what is good for you, go and get my daughter. Else, I'm going to raise down this whole house. Ha! Richard, can you say what you cannot do? Raise down what? Okay. Look, Mom, it hasn't gotten to that. We are all traveling down to Asaba. To look for Nelly. By God's grace, we'll find her there. Dad, you're coming with us. Count me out. 
not coming with you to anywhere. I cannot. Somebody walked away from home and want me to go looking for her. You want to go, like I said, you go. I cannot stop you. Nelly, Nelly. Yeah. What what happened? You, you don't look okay. Dad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm so sorry for everything. I'm sorry. I should have listened to you. Tell me, what, what went wrong? Mom, he got married right under my nose. He only confessed to me when I saw his traditional marriage photographs today. But I thought he loves you. <laughs> Mom, he never loved me. He never did. He only saw me as his meal ticket out of poverty. <laughs> Your dad was right after all. <laughs> dad, I am so sorry. I should have listened to you. See? What an old man sees sitting down. A young child will not say it even if he climbed the mountain top. I said it from the onset. <laughs> That boy was a gold digger. Honey, <laughs> honey, please. Please, just find a place in your heart to forgive her. I think she has finally realized her mistake. Please, darling. <laughs> Babandu, my love, please, I beg you. She's your only daughter. Get up. Thank you. Get Thank up. you, darling. It's all right, darling. Oh. Thank you, darling. Thank you, honey. It's okay, baby. It's all right. Second Baptist. Nelly, I'm so happy to have you home. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome, dear. I have missed you a great deal. Nelly, at least you're here now. Okay, I'm here. Yeah, I'm going to say, I'm starting work of jail on Monday. No time to waste. Uh, honey, I am so sorry for misunderstanding you. I never knew you were right in your judgment. Please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am so sorry. I forgave you long ago. Hmm. So, can I come back to our room? I didn't drive you from the room. You went out from your home just now. Okay. You want to come back? You come back to All right, I'm coming back as soon as possible. In fact, after dinner. Come back. That's what I'm here. So we can. Uh, uh, you know, darling. <laughs> it shall never be well with that boy. He came to destroy our peaceful home. When I was telling you that the boy is the gold digger, you thought I hated our brother and I don't want to have it. Okay. He must pay dearly for what he has done. He must. No, we're not for the crosses. Let's just leave him to God. Yeah, I think. You know she's right. Enough. Nelly, dear, are you okay? Yes, ma'am. You, you're not eating your food? Yes, ma'am. Oh, all right. Eat up, okay? Well, um, nice of you to have got, I must say. 
Well, I added my personal touch, but thank oh. you. <laughs> Regardless. Hi, Sandra and the kids. Oh, they are good. Actually, I was driving by and I decided to say hi. Oh, mm -hmm. that's so thoughtful of you. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, what would you expect? When I have a beautiful friend like you, actually an old friend. So oh, I have to that? <laughs> hi, is Dad and Mom, how are they? Oh, they should be fine. What do you mean they should be fine? I talked to them on the phone. I mean they should be fine. You you don't you don't live at home anymore? Oh come on, that's a long time ago. I've I've moved out of the house, man. I stay alone with my family. Oh yeah, that's <laughs> oh nice one. Let me try this. Yeah. When I got married. Okay. I thought it wise to leave the house for them because I I found out I needed privacy with my wife. Ah. Uh. I can see the result of that privacy. Oh, really? Oh, I'm not in any. <laughs> oh, come on, Junior, you're naughty. Mm. Well, the truth is, my wife is actually doing a good job. <sighs> Decorum. Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you will never change. So, tell me, you just strolled here without even getting me anything. What's wrong with you? Well, um, what is wrong with me stopping by to say hi to my old friend? No, there's there's nothing wrong with you stopping by. There's actually something wrong with you not getting me a drink at least. Okay, yeah. maybe I'll do that the next time I come around. I promise you that. But meanwhile, I need to hurry up back to my chambers. Mm. I'll see you some other time. Yeah, lots of criminals that need to get out. <laughs> <laughs> you always like this. Um, <laughs> Take care of you, Junior. Right, and my right. regards to Sandra and the kids. Okay. Tell them I'll come see them, see them one of these days, okay? Alright, darling. Alright, take care. <laughs> oh, Junior. Gracious me. Nelly! Mm -hmm. um, sorry, have we met? Bobby. Engineer Bobby, the electrician. Oh, Bobby. <laughs> you changed a whole lot. Well, let's just say we are aging gracefully. Oh, yes. nice. <laughs> really nice. So, what about your man? Uh, we broke up. Oh, so sorry. What happened? <sighs> Well, it's a long story. Let's just... You can make it short. <laughs> long story short, found out he had a wife. End of story. That's too bad. One of those things. Uh, well, my parents told me that you lost your wife. So sorry about that. Um, yeah, she died during childbirth. Oh, so sorry. Thank I'm sorry, you. I didn't mean to remind you of what had happened to you in the past. Well, it's okay. Uh, so, what happened to your car? Well, I don't know. It just sort of, sort of started jerking. Then it stopped here, and I've been here trying to figure it out, but to no avail. I don't know. Okay, let me just take a look. Just stop. As you can see, we're pushing it. Uh, how have you been since the last time I saw you? Where have you been? Yeah, I traveled to the village. Okay. My aunt sent for me, so she asked me to come and see something in the village, okay. which I didn't like. Oh, I guess she wanted to buy land, mm -hmm. right? Um, Nelly, 
What about us having a dinner date tonight? <sighs> Please don't say no. Please. <sighs> Is that a yes? Uh, sure. Sure. Thank you. Why are you thanking me? Of course, we're sitting to go on a dinner date with me. Mm. Oh. Well, I can see you're doing real well. Oh, well, I'm sick. I'm just a girl in love. I didn't know I Thanks for inviting me out. You're welcome. I've missed you once before and I am not ready to miss you again. I want you to be the mother of my kids. Good to see you. Uh, why are you off to on foot? Your car? Uh, I was actually headed down the road to go see a friend. Uh, okay, and your car? A lot of things happened. Yeah. yeah. It's okay. I could just give you a lift. Uh, no, no, no. Just I'm not going too far. Just down the road. Are you pregnant? Ah, uh, yes, married and pregnant. Ah, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sure your wife and kids are doing great. Yeah. Super. Okay. It's just have a good day. You too. Yeah. Bye. 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 Yeah. 